Missouri's channel. <laughs> what are we doing today, girl? What are we trying? Whole Foods grossest weirdest snacks? I'm nervous. I know we do. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm here with Ajazi. Her channel will be linked in the description bar. She's doing a really fun video tomorrow. Followers control my life for a day. I'm so excited. And Missouri's also here. So if you hear snorting noises in the background like this, I apologize. <laughs> Today, we are going to be trying Whole Foods weirdest, healthiest snacks. I want you to edit it in like right here. Uh -huh. <laughs> I just basically went to Whole Foods and picked out things that looked strange. Most of this is vegan and gluten free, by the way. We just didn't want to jack her up for the sake of the video. <laughs> I think we should start with salty and then sweet. go into sweet. Yeah. Haven't tried any of this stuff before. There are, no, these chips right here I've tried before. I just want you to try them because I'm like curious on what you think. Mm -hmm. Because my friends hated this. Diana and Mihai hated them. I love them, so I want you to try them. And then we have a bunch of. Super duper weird snack. I don't like party. <laughs> Wait, this matches our outfit. Oh. These are called Vienna Baked Chickpea Puffs, and the flavor is blazing hot. Now, I don't do hot. Oh my god, hot. It's hot. Oh. It doesn't taste like anything until it gets hot. It is anything but fire. Do I need water? And I wouldn't eat them, but they're edible. Crunchy kale chips, and the flavor is naked. Naked. They don't look naked, that's for sure. Wait, wait. This, is like, this is what they look like. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. What's on them? Why does it break up like that? Oh, whoa. That's so weird. They're almost like cheese coated, yeah, but it's not like, cheese. I think it's cashew and chickpea. I actually don't like that at all. We should rate them. Yeah. Okay, Blazing Hots, I would give like a six. Yeah. Especially if you like um, like hot flavors, like if you like hot Cheetos and you can't have them. Yeah. Yeah. Six. six. Yeah. yeah. Mm -mm. <laughs> it wasn't like spit out and disgusted, yeah. so I could give a solid like three. Yeah. I didn't three. <laughs> so these are called organic beet chips in the flavor sea salt. I don't like these at all. Go. I'm so sorry. <laughs> The, I, I would never willingly buy this. Cheers. Oh, it's gonna break my tooth. It tastes like beef. Oh. It really tastes like beef. I, I have to spit it out. Okay. Oh <laughs> These are like drenched in salt. They still taste like beef. Your mouth is all red. Oh, that's not good. I have an IT. <laughs> All right. Okay. Zero. Zero. Negative. In the negatives for that one. This is the only thing that I've tried before. Do you like sea salt and vinegar? I love salt and vinegar. Okay. Types. Organic rich plantain chips in sea salt and vinegar. I don't hate them. Oh, yeah? mm -hmm. I don't know why. I love them. Like, I would rate them like a solid nine. I would say like an eight just okay. because I eat glaze. Uh, so it's hard to like compare. Like, if I couldn't eat chips. Yeah. Especially because there's so many like hydrogenated oils and mm. stuff in it that yeah, this is our solid substitute. All right, let's do this one. This is uh, veggie chips. Mm. Taste good. Oh, yeah. Like if you bake a sweet potato, like a piece of a sweet potato, really, really long. The ingredients are really good. It's like flaxseed, yams, carrot, buckwheat. I can actually eat them. Seven and a half. Mm -hmm. I love seaweed so much. Sriracha and almond. A lot going on. It looks, it looks good. Promising? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. I'm a fan. So am I. Party in your mouth. Uh-huh. Like there is a lot going on, but everything that's going on is, I think this is like, Probably gonna be, as far as expectations go, it's gonna be the worst in my opinion. These are literally called skinny crisps. If you promote I, it like that, yeah, you know it's like, gonna be a problem. And the flavor is plain Jane. Looks like a pita. Smells like nothing. Oh my god, sure. Eating sand. Yeah, it breaks up into grains of sand. Doesn't it spit out? If you're like, you. if you're feeling nauseous and you need to eat something that it's like, just like nothing, I get that that could be it. I still wouldn't want still to <laughs> not eat. I'd rather not eat. Let's do the drinks and then the sweets, yeah? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so I got two. Th these just looked strange. Like this is literally green or blue. blue. It says it's a low glycemic lemonade and Ajazi loves lemonade. Chicken, chicken. <laughs> it just tastes like lemon juice watered down. It's watered down lemon juice. But like not lemonade. I mean like I'll drink it because I think it has a lot of like good stuff for mm -hmm. you in here. Now this one is a hydration workout. It looks a little teeny tiny. Oh god. Don't. How am I supposed to drink it after she makes a face like that? I'm just to water that down. I can smell it. It smells very clean. <laughs> I would rate this like a five, like totally drinkable. This is like a three. It's like a three, yeah. I'm excited for this part. This is like the sweet part, yeah. and I have like the sweet tooth. So this brand, Urban Remedy, is super popular in Whole Foods. Like I see it everywhere. I figured like we want to try this stuff out. We're gonna try the banana coconut sprouted almond. <laughs> Just brittle. <laughs> banana brittle. <laughs> If you don't know, Mariana eats nuts and seeds like a hunter-gatherer, so <laughs> at the grocery store, we'll grab nuts from the dispenser. Eat granola straight out the bag. It looks like promising. it looks good, yeah. Mm -hmm. It smells good too, and I love coconut. I think the banana is a little overpowering for me. Mm -hmm. You can really taste the banana in this, so if you don't like it. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> it's cooked. I'm allergic to banana, in case you're wondering. I forgot. Five. I would have told you. Let me grab the happy pad. Please just keep me updated. I'm good. <laughs> you start like. This one is called Super, it's like a superfood bar, and it's chaga and super green flavored stuff. It's not for you, you can't have chocolate. I don't want both of you today. I love you, Ben, only works on one of us. This is what it looks like. Mmm. Mmm. Okay, let's do the other one. Yeah, it's basically the same thing, but it's matcha flavored. That's what it looks like. <laughs> oh, I like it. Oh, I like it. Oh, I like it. That was worse than the beach hit. Allie did a stream. So like drink that. the chlorophyll instead. Allie, <laughs> <laughs> it's time for everything. Grand Island? Let's Ooh. go ahead and cut into some right. stuff. Guys. To start off, I think it's raw. <laughs> There's no dairy here. Here's the packaging. Yeah. It's called uh, Capello's Gluten-Free, Vegan, and Dairy-Free Chocolate Chip Cookie Dough, and it looks like a sausage. <laughs> it just looks so weird. It feels like a sausage. It does. It's like it's like that's so weird. Yeah. We're gonna try a little bit of it because I was under the impression that it's raw cookie dough that you can like eat it. I think it is raw, like because the oh, ingredients, yeah. but yeah. it still says baking instructions on the back. <laughs> Oh my god. That's really satisfying. There's a lot of cookie dough. There's a lot of chocolate chips, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. It tastes a little flowery. Oh my god. For vegan, like for vegan, gluten-free, and... Majority type over this yeah. one, y'all. It's, um, it's made out of almond flour and Vermont maple syrup. Oh, maple syrup. Yeah. This brand is like, they're very on and off. Like, one thing is so mm -hmm. good and then the next thing it's is like... Miss. But this is their raw cacao mousse. Gluten-free, non-GMO, vegan, and dairy-free. Luscious raw cacao mousse with hints of vanilla, date, and pink Himalayan salt. Cheers. Oh. Okay. Mm. 10 out of 10. What? Oh, we forgot to rate. For the cookie dough, I would rate a 10 out of 10, too. Yeah. Especially for like it being vegan and gluten-free. I was not expecting that. Me, too. Oh. Wow. White chocolate latte truffles. Like, like, <laughs> I don't want to say it. I know, me either. Don't even say it. Give me the back. <laughs> Fuck. But it's so bad. I still taste it. Me too. Ew. That's oh, horrific. Right the lemon really cuts. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have one last thing. Quinoa and blueberry pudding. Looks like overnight oats, kind of. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ooh, yummy. Oh, it's really good. This pudding, the Urban Remedy pudding, this cookie dough, mm -hmm. definitely a big yes. And then this oh, Urban Remedy bar was good. 
And then the quinoa and, and this blue. one will kill you. <laughs> and the quinoa and blueberry pudding was really good. Like top four. Oh, we should do this again. We should do this maybe oh. Trader Joe's. We could do like a Ralph's. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Like a series. Yeah. Oh, I would love that. Mm -hmm. Well, a Jazzy channel will be linked in the description bar, so be sure to check it out. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. We're definitely gonna do more. Like I feel like this was great. This yeah, was fun. This was so fun. We'll be doing more, especially more videos together in the future too. Yeah. We're thinking like Q and A soon. Yeah. Um, she's gonna have an apartment tour of this place on her channel soon, and it is so cute because she's like Thanks. the best at decorating. Thank you guys for watching. Thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and we'll see you in the next one.